Illinois fur bearers. There are about 60 species of wild mammal in Illinois. What is a mammal? It's an animal with four limbs. It has hair or fur. It is warm-blooded. Its body temperature is kept at the same level instead of being controlled by the environment. Most female mammals bear young that develop in a special organ, the uterus. After birth, mammal young are fed with milk produced by the female's mammary glands. Mammals have a large and complex brain. Wild mammals in Illinois include the marsupials, insectivores, bats, rabbits, rodents, carnivores, and ungulates. Fur bearer is a term that is used mainly by wildlife biologists to describe mammals that are hunted or trapped, usually for their valuable fur. There are 14 species of fur bearer in Illinois. To some people, trapping, hunting, and the use of fur are controversial issues. Here are some facts to help you understand hunting and trapping of fur bears. Hunting and trapping are highly regulated. More than 75 state, federal, and international laws apply to hunting and trapping of fur bears in Illinois. These laws provide standards for animal welfare, require licenses and training, and set limits on hunting and trapping so that populations remain healthy. Fur bears are a common species. As of 2016, it will be legal to hunt or trap all 14 species of fur bears in Illinois. Thanks to conservation efforts, some species once considered rare in Illinois are now thriving. Examples include the American beaver, North American river otter, and bobcat. Most of these species that are hunted or trapped in Illinois are capable of giving birth to and raising many young in a short period of time. Even with diseases, predators, and other factors causing death, many individuals remain that can be harvested by hunting or trapping. Society benefits from responsible harvest of fur bears. Regulated hunting and trapping help to keep fur bear populations at acceptable levels, reduce property damage caused by fur bearers, raise funds for the conservation of wildlife, and provide a wide range of materials and products for human use, including but not limited to fur garments, soap, pet foods, livestock feed, paint, tires, textiles, and construction materials. Several publications from the IDNR can provide you with more information about hunting and trapping. You will find them through the publication order form at this website. The fur bears in Illinois represent several types of mammals. Marsupials, Virginia opossum. The opossum is found statewide and can live about anywhere on land from woods to cities. It eats plants and animal materials such as fruits, grains, eggs, worms, garbage, and pet food. It is active at night. When the young are born, they are very small and an entire litter can fit into the area the size of a teaspoon. They crawl into a pouch on the mother's body and stay there for about two months to complete their development. Rodents American Beaver The beaver is the largest rodent in Illinois. This nocturnal mammal has a large, flat tail and webbed feet to help it swim. Beavers spend most of their time in water, going to land only to rest, rear young, and feed. Plant materials that it finds along the streams, rivers, ponds, and lakes make up the diet. Beavers are able to cut down trees to build lodges and dams. Muskrat The muskrat lives statewide in Illinois rivers, lakes, ponds, streams, ditches, and marshes. It feeds on cattails and other aquatic plants and sometimes will take crayfishes, mussels, and other aquatic animals. It may build a house out of vegetation or use a burrow in a pond or stream bank as its home. Carnivores Coyote The coyote may be found statewide in Illinois living in woodlands, bluffs, prairies, and urban areas. It eats mice, rabbits, fruits, dead animals, and other items. Young are raised in a burrow or den. Red Fox The red fox is found statewide living in grasslands, urban areas, bottomland woods, and brushy areas. It eats prey that it catches as well as some plant materials. Its diet changes by season. In summer and fall, it feeds mainly on insects and plant materials. In winter and spring, it eats many small mammals. It is usually active at night. An underground burrow is used for raising its young. Gray fox 
The gray fox can be found statewide, mainly in woodlands, especially where they are close to open fields, and can also be found in urban areas. Cottontails, mice, insects, birds, crayfishes, and plant materials are among the many types of food items eaten by this species. In the winter, small mammals make up most of the diet. A den is used for raising young. The gray fox can easily climb trees. Long-tailed weasel. Found statewide, the long-tailed weasel lives in brushy areas, woodlands, grasslands, along roads, and near farm buildings. It eats birds, lizards, small mammals, and snakes. Active at night, it uses the burrows of other small mammals, crevices, or brush piles to hide in during the day. Least weasel. The least weasel can be found in the northern one half of Illinois. It lives in grassy fields, along railroad tracks, and along the edges of cultivated fields. It feeds on small birds, mice, and other small mammals and invertebrates. It may kill more prey than it needs at one time and store the food for later. When disturbed, it may release a musky odor. American Mink The American Mink can be found statewide near streams, rivers, ponds, lakes, and marshes. It eats small birds, fishes, amphibians, reptiles, small mammals, and invertebrates. It is active mainly at night and moves well both in and out of water. It may take over a muskrat burrow or lodge for shelter or live in a brush pile or under a stump. American Badger The American Badger may be found statewide in open areas such as pastures, roadsides, along railroad tracks, brushy areas, and alfalfa fields. It is usually active at night and eats mammals such as woodchucks, ground squirrels, mice, and voles. It is a powerful digger and uses this skill to find food and provide shelter. North American River Otter The North American River Otter is found throughout Illinois in rivers, swamps, and lakes. It eats fishes, crayfishes, turtles, frogs, mussels, and other aquatic animals. It is active during the day and night. It swims strongly and bounds on land. Striped Skunk this mammal is found statewide in Illinois in pastures, fence rows, roadsides, and woodlands. It eats a variety of foods including insects, birds, dead animals, garbage, small mammals, and plant materials. It raises its young in an underground burrow. Active at night, it is known for its bad-smelling scent that is sprayed on any animal that it considers a threat. Raccoon the raccoon is easily recognized by the black markings on its face and the dark rings on its tail. It lives statewide in a variety of habitats, including urban areas. It eats prey that it catches, as well as plant materials. It is very common in cities, where it feeds on garbage and pet food and lives in hollow trees and buildings. Active at night, this species is a good climber and swimmer. Bobcat the bobcat lives in wooded bluffs or rolling hills mixed with open fields, brushy ravines, swamps, or open woodlands along streams. Found statewide, it is active at night, feeding on cottontails, squirrels, mice, birds, and other animals. Individuals can live up to about 15 years in the wild.